All right, boys. Looks like it's time for Sam. They were both pretty intense. Oh wow. <laughs> Look at him. Sam spent his life shooting photos, but mom said he got nervous being in front of the camera. I guess we're all afraid of something. Oh, wow. That is an awesome rifle. Two sixty-eight. Instead of hiding from death, Sam seemed to go out of his way to meet it. <laughs> that's actually really cool. Like, that's... I have two cats, so I find this kind of, like, gross and like, kind of wrong. But at the same time, that's so cool. The house cat looking as fierce as possible against a squirrel. It's just awesome. Okay. I think that's basically it. Hey. That's what's left of her belongings, it looks like. Okay. Let's go here. Oh, look. Unsealed. I promise, you'll never forget this weekend. Yes, sir. These memories are going to last a lifetime. Mm hmm Am I going to have to shoot anything? It's a hunting trip, Don. Shooting is strongly encouraged. What? Perfect. <laughs> it's going to rain the whole weekend, isn't it? Never forget this weekend, Dad. That's the spirit. Okay, got it. I'm gonna take some pictures, okay? Just be careful. The camera's older than you are. Ah, can't focus it right. You're right, Dad. It's starting to clear up. It's still freezing, though. I've drunk all that coffee. Hmm. Hold still. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> That's a keeper. I'm just saying, I'm not always going to be here, Don. You'll need to remember this stuff if you want to survive. I'll be fine, Dad. You know who else thought he was going to be fine? Some guy who died. Don, I'm being serious. I know, Dad. You're always serious. Doesn't being out here make you want to chill out? Well, to tell you the truth, I haven't been out here in 20 years. Should I take a picture of next? Dad! Good eyes, Don. Before you take the shot, let me get a picture of you. Dad, I... <laughs> survive you need to be strong great shot Don holy crap <laughs> oh, I was trying to get him to focus in a little bit but I can't Proud of you, Don. Always remember that, okay? Oh. <laughs> Good. Turn. Sorry, Don. Just gotta reset the timer. Oh. I didn't realize. Oh God, I didn't realize I was timed. I messed up. Okay, go, 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 go. 
Red! Red! We got this voice! Oh god! Dad! It's twitching! I think That's it's totally so normal, Don. Just focus on the camera. Try not to think about- Dad! Oh! <gasps> oh no! <laughs> oh! Talk about a way to go out. Of all these stories, that's the one I wish most that my mom had told me. Wow. <laughs> oh, what? I didn't even see that. Is that a radio? Don't tell me he's got like a ham radio in here. That would be perfect. <laughs> the rest of the AC. Meal ready to Yep, of course you got MREs. That only makes sense. You were a military man. After Sam died, my mom and Edie got really close. They'd both lost a lot. Inch control. <laughs> oh, wow. Gregory. Wow. Oh, no. I'm going to go and read this, boys, and then um, I'll skip ahead. And if you want, you guys can pause and read it. Dear Kay, do you remember the way Gregory used to laugh when he thought he was alone? Like something funny was happening, but only he could see it. Oh, what the? Okay. Oh. <laughs> oh, this is so cute.
Come on. Okay, I got it. Okay, so I got to get on the wheel. <laughs> Sorry about that, Gregory. I know you did everything you could. Oh, maybe if I hadn't called that night. I don't want Gregory to hear this. Oh. Damn. Oh, he's got lockers. Regular mil military style right here. Dawn and Gus. I can't imagine my mom ever writing poetry and yet... Race flag. Breakfast. Quiet time. Sweep trash. Mop mow yard. Greg be a baby. <laughs> Routine jump rope. Jumping jacks. Push ups. Crunches. Run to mailbox and back. He was basically training them. I get it though. He was just trying to be a good father. Trying to teach them. Nine to eighty-two. Poem for Gus. A poem for Gus, who always said the wedding was a bad idea. Our father never hit us kids, at least not very hard, before the day my brother said with teenage disregard that he'd be dead before he'd see a wedding in our yard. Father made him come, of course, but Gus stood far apart, just flew his kite and bottled up the storm inside his heart. Okay, why can't I read this next piece? Oh, do I, I need to? Talk to oh. But though he'd never met her, we don't need a stepmom. Were the words that I now pronounce you, husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. Where's the next verse? Ah. 
time for photos came, Dad ordered him to come, come here. But Gus declined, and as a sign held up his middle finger. <laughs> But all the humans did that day was go inside the tent. Oh, wow. The rain came down in buckets then, but no one seemed afraid that nature might destroy the tent our dad had crudely made. Okay, where's the next verse? There it is. The thunder sounded much too close and full of angry power. But all my father said to this was, Make the music louder. Oh no, tell me he's, he flies his kite during a storm and gets electrocuted. Uh-oh. Oh, maybe not. I wish that I could truly say I thought about you on that day. Out there on the beach alone. Just you, the wind, the sea, and foam. Oh, no. But I didn't. Until we found you. It sounds like he got crushed by the tent. She never talked about him, but mom told me once if I was a boy, they were going to name me Gus. <laughs> oh. Alright, boys. See you guys in the next one. Peace. Bye.